In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix your Kindle Oasis not turning on. So the first thing we're going to do is just grab our device and you want to disconnect any charging cables you currently have going to your Kindle. Now, once it's free from any cables, we're just going to come over to the top of the Kindle and you'll see this power button. Now, what we're going to do is just hold this button down for around about 40 seconds. So you just need to keep holding it down until 40 seconds have passed. I'd recommend using a timer on your phone just to make sure you wait that full 40 seconds. And essentially what will happen is when you hold this button for long enough, it's going to perform a hard reset and your Kindle should then turn on. Now, if for some reason this isn't working for you, then what we're going to do is just grab our charging cable and we're going to plug the charger into the Kindle like so, and then just make sure it's plugged into a wall socket or somewhere like your laptop. And once your Kindle is charging, we're then just going to leave it on charge for around about 20 minutes. Now, once 20 minutes have passed, we're then going to come back over to our Kindle and you want to leave the charging cable plugged in like so and once again we're just going to come over to the top of the kindle and hold down this power button once again for 40 seconds so basically exactly what we tried before but this time we're just going to leave it on charge while we do this and once again just wait until 40 seconds have passed and you can check to see if that now turns back on now if it's still not working it could indicate an issue with the cable itself or maybe the actual power outlet so what i'd recommend doing is try changing the cable if you have a spare cable lying around you can also try changing the power outlet so if it's currently plugged into a wall then you could try plugging it into your laptop for example otherwise you could just try blowing into either ends of the cable just to make sure there's no dust or debris stuck inside of there you may also have dust or something stuck in the actual charging port on the kindle so it's also worth blowing inside of here or using some kind of compressed air and once you've followed all of these steps, that should have now fixed your issue. If you did find this video helpful, then let me know in the comments and I'll see you in the next one.